extra, extra! Rob is finally put in cage. The entirety of the Robin. Mr. Holmes, please come in. Now that the police have finished their investigation, Il Palazzo del Lusso has finally reopened. Can I help you, sir? Good day. I'm looking for room 227. An acquaintance of mine has invited me to visit him. Oh, Mr. Holmes, what a delight to see you again. Professor Malice told me he was expecting someone, but I didn't know it would be you. 227 is upstairs and to the left. He said you should spare him the trouble and let yourself in. Here's the key. I'm sure he'll be thrilled to see you. Professor Malice, yes. Yes, of course. Well, I'd best not keep him waiting, thank you. Clean champagne flute. The first move has been made. Anglo Egyptian war looms. The champagne bottle is uncorked yet still chilled and bubbly. The gall of this man. Someone's celebrating a victory, and I'm not sure it's us. <sighs> M is celebrating and wants us to know it. A marked map of Cordona. We've visited most of these locations recently. Jacob Haring, just a pawn in a complex chess match. Mycroft's agent. So M did orchestrate her accident with unimaginable precision. The position of naval forces in the Mediterranean. This M has his sights set on bigger things. All these thefts, exactions and deaths are the intricately entwined pieces of a greater plan and we fail to influence it in the slightest.
family photo of the man who jumped off the bridge. Pity. Everybody has pressure points. What would happen if I pushed yours? How many more dossiers like this does M possess? <laughs> Mysteries of Sirius B by Jacob Haring. Used, then discarded. Like everyone in his path. These people were not colleagues or co-conspirators, they were just implements M used to get what he wanted. What did it say, Sherry? That I failed, John. He's gone, tore through Cordona like a hurricane and left us to sift through the wreckage. Nelson's Monument in Trafalgar Square, London. I am watching you. The hairs on my neck just stood up. <laughs> Extensive handwritten notes on Sirius B. It appears M was studying up. A dossier on General Garnet Wolseley, but now empty. I recognize this seal from Jacob Haring's mail. He left behind only what he wanted us to find infuriating. We're too late, Sherry. M set this all up for us, knowing by the time we found it, he would already have left Cordona. No, no, there must be something I've missed. We can still catch him. There's nothing else here. It's over. You read his letter. He laid out this makeshift museum to taunt you. Don't give him the satisfaction. I will not cede defeat. I will treat this threat with the seriousness it deserves, which is to say, my absolute attention. Then you were giving him the win, Sherlock. Have you considered you might be out of your depth? He was sitting here in this very room, spinning his web around Cordona and beyond, manipulating and murdering people, using the Mediterranean as his playground like some sodding Napoleon of crime. Are you trying to suggest? I am not suggesting. I am stating outright that he is toying with you and you are too arrogant to avoid the bait. Sherlock, we stumbled into the lion's den. Now we must slow down, be smart and make sure we get to walk out alive. When a fly gets caught in a spider's web, it twitches. But the more it does so, the more it traps itself. You are twitching too much, John. Do not mistake my rage for recklessness. Do not mistake disappointment for desperation. The spider does not yet know what it caught. He knows full well. The man makes no mistakes, Sherlock. Incorrect. He just made one. He caught my attention. That's what I'm saying. You are behaving exactly how I'd expect. He wants you to come after him. He knows you can't resist the game. You need to face the facts. You lost. You were outwitted and he got away. Don't fall for it again. The smartest thing we can do now is lick our wounds and tell Mycroft everything. Mycroft, now you really are being hysterical. Look around you, Sherlock. He's stealing secrets from the Crown, toying with navies, fomenting war. You cannot catch him alone. We will need all your brother's connections to stop this madman before he does worse. Perhaps you're right. He could be anywhere in Europe, and the only practical way to find him is with Mycroft's eyes and ears. <sighs> I shall endeavour to tell my brother the whole story as soon as I can stomach another humiliation. Good. Thank you. And it is not humiliation. It is humility. 
For now, we need to put this wretched affair behind us. M has gone. Best to focus on the reason we came to Gordona in the first place. You're right. I'm glad you were here. I'm always looking out for you, brother. Thank you, John. Now, shall we? <laughs>